Nabil Kareem joins us now with your morning sports and the weather is affecting so many people, even the Montreal Canadiens. Yeah, interesting story. Yesterday the team had to switch buses due to mechanical problems and they left Carey Price's gear on the bus. They forgot it actually. So they left it overnight. Uh, it came frozen obviously uh, and Price couldn't use it in the morning skate yesterday. And as we know, athletes are creatures of routine. They love the routine, doing the same things over and over and Carey Price wasn't too happy that he couldn't use his gear yesterday. Might have thrown him off a little bit yesterday in their game against the Caps. Would have just been a little cold. How did they do against the Capitals? Well, it was interesting because the Caps have a lot to prove too and uh, the Washington Capitals were recently polled as the most overrated team in the NHL. If the Caps want to shake that label, they'll need more from Alex Ovechkin down the stretch. The sniper has just 19 goals this season and only two on the power play. Stick pick it up in the first period. Matthew Perot coming over the blue line. Gets a shot that goes through Price. Maybe Price. Uh, the pads may be still thawing out a little bit. one nothing for the Caps. Jump to the end of the second. Now Brian Giotz has sprung loose. He snaps it. Blocker side. Nice goal here. The captain's second of the game and we're tied at two. This one going to a shootout where Gionta beats Simeon Varlamov. So Alex Ovechkin needs to score. But Price coming up with the big pad save here. Maybe the equipment not so frozen anymore. Habs win this one. Three to two. Flames and Predators will pick this one up in the third. Predators up 1-0. Matt Stajan unloading here. Bad goal here for Pe uh, Pekka Rene. Game tied to 1-0. That one going through a 5-hole. Then on the power play, Ryan Suter over to Patrick Holmquist. He makes it 2-1 for Nashville. Calgary getting that one back, though. Alex Tange from behind the net to Corey Sarge. Game tied to 2. Another shootout we go here is Rene Bork. The first shooter, nice goal here. Slips it under Rene's leg. That would be your game winner. 3-2 is the final. Calgary has now won five in a row. Canucks and Stars deep in the heart of Texas. Vancouver scoring two in about three minutes, so we'll pick this one up in a second. The Stars respond. Louis Erickson and Brendan Moore on the two-on-one. Erickson keeps and shoots. Nice goal here beating Corey Schneider, making it two to one. Still in the second, Canucks special team strike. Yannick Hansen, Ryan Kessler on a two-on-one of their own. Odd man rush. Hansen over to Kessler, 28th of the year. He's having some year. That's a shorthanded tally. Vancouver goes on to the 4-1 win. They're now tops of the NHL in points, and that's your look at sports.